I'm me swatching makeup like my beauty guru days. This is the packaging for the holiday stuff. love having leftovers for breakfast yes it's 7 30 a.m yes i'm eating trader joe's chicken fried rice but i just had my coffee earlier this morning and i'm gonna get in my reds today ehp oxy reds when i tell you this tastes like juice like pomegranate cranberry juice it is like something that i crave and i love the oxy green so i got really excited when this was up on the website so i got mine in the raspberry refresh this has like your antioxidants which has really been great for my skin it helps with blood flow energy and vitality it has strawberry and pomegranate acai raspberry beet like it literally tastes and sounds so good and it has like a nice little tart aftertaste which is what i love so i've been making that every day doesn't matter if i get it in in the morning or in the evening but also i do have a discount code if you guys want to use k10 at checkout you could save on all of my faves over at ehp labs so i'm gonna enjoy my chicken fried rice it's definitely like a cozy meal i feel like it's gonna be a day of First of all, like fall vibes. We're gonna hang out today. I have some packages of things that I want to show you guys. But first, big thank you to my friends over at Dossier for sponsoring this part of today's video because oh my god, they have their Black Friday sale going off right now. Basically, the biggest sale of the year. Everything up to 55% off. I'm talking diffusers, candles fragrances everybody is faves at such great prices so i have to put you guys on if i haven't already so i'm gonna link dossier in the description box below along with the discount code so you guys can get in on these deals i do feel like their stuff make really great gifts especially the diffusers they have the best like luxury dupes when it comes to the home scents. Like I literally needed them all. So I think these would be really cute like stocking stuffers and you don't have to break the bank. So this is what the packaging looks like for the diffusers. I love how minimal and like neutral this is. It's super aesthetic. So this scent looks like this. It gives you a card of what it's supposed to smell like and this one i'm so excited because i love this in the fragrance and dossier does theirs so good it is the dossier embery cherry which is inspired by tom ford's lost cherry i needed this for my bedroom because it is like perfectly nutty but sweet and it has that bit of almond in it as well so i think this is going to be a really nice cozy fall scent and when i tell you like you walk into the room you're gonna smell it it's so nice and there's scents that actually last so the embry cherry has notes of cherry almond cinnamon like how fall vibes does that sound clove rose jasmine plum along with balsam tonka bean and vanilla and of course i had to get myself a dossier candle i've tried their candles out before and i th i can't remember what scent it was but since then because at that time i believe they had like one or two different options maybe now they have more home scents which makes me excited because your whole home space can smell bougie but on a budget so what girl or guy doesn't love candles which is why like this is the perfect time y'all get your candles get your home scents stock up so this one is the embry vanilla which is inspired by the ysl black opium fragrance i love the dossier fragrance also they do fragrances in candles too which is insane so this one already smells super good my mom 
it smells like my mom. <laughs> it has mandarin, pear, pink pepper, licorice, jasmine, orange blossom, cedarwood, patchouli, vanilla, and coffee. I'm definitely picking up on the vanilla and the coffee in this. This is one of my top fragrances from Dossier, so I definitely wanted to get my hands on the candle and see what that was giving because it's totally fall vibes. You get a lot of candle. Like, they repackaged this since the first time that I ever tried it, which means they're basically improving their stuff which i love to see and they all have like such simplistic labels and my favorite part is they have the notes on the fragrances and the candles so you know what exactly it is supposed to smell like and this one is a two wick like you can't tell me this with like a diffuser combo isn't gonna be like a perfect gift like heck gift it for yourself if nobody else like this Mm, it just smells so cozy vibes. You definitely don't want to sleep on their home fragrances. I think a lot of us love Dossier for their perfumes and everything, and I just love to see them come out with home scents that are just as amazing as their fragrances. Last but not least, I have another candle to show you guys. Again, this is the packaging to keep it nice and safe while it comes to your crib. And I really couldn't decide. There was one scent. I hope this is it. It was the Killian inspired fragrance. Because I love that one. It is so sweet. And I always wondered what it would smell like in a candle. <gasps> You're lying. This is it. Why did I just get chills, guys? They make this fragrance so well. I literally have the Killian Love Don't Be Shy. The real thing, which is expensive. But I also have the Dossier version. I believe it's right here floral marshmallow i've gone through several bottles of these it is so cozy vibes if you like sweet fragrances but not like childish like candy like this is very grown it's rihanna's favorite scent then you're gonna love the dossier version of killian love don't be shy the first note is marshmallow so it's extremely sweet like i mentioned it also has bergamot which i find helps to balance out the fragrance along with orange blossom honeysuckle jasmine oris amber vanilla and musk so basically all my favorite things in one so i can't decide now oh my god how do they do it i can't decide what i want to burn first this is very light i just feel like for your bathroom and you're having a bubble bath and you like this you're taking a bath by candlelight watching your favorite show on your ipad like it's giving all the vibes so you guys definitely don't want to miss out on dossier's biggest sale again up to 55 percent off everything so i'm gonna link them down below don't say i didn't put you on don't say it i don't want to hear it I did order something from Skims. They did their like holiday shop and I bought stuff from it last year. I have my like Skims onesie pajamas and they came out with like new prints. I didn't get any of those because I have the ones here and it's totally giving Vlogmas vibes. So many cute like um, soft lounge pieces and like pajamas and stuff like that and I love soft lounge. I'm wearing like one of the soft lounge t-shirts. These joggers are actually Gymshark, which are up on the website right now, and I like the whole, like, tonal look. So, I'll show you guys what I got. Why did I spend $60 on underwear? That don't even sound right. Ooh, it's packaged cute, though. Part of my Christmas gift to myself. This is the packaging for the holiday stuff so I guess like if you wanted to gift it to somebody it would already come super cute but these are gifts to me and I haven't bought skims in so long um honestly I need to unsubscribe from the mailer because it's just too many launches and y'all know I'm out here trying to save but I love these undies and I've been wanting to get a set like from last year in like neutral colors they did this in like pinks and reds but who's walking around with the red panties not me so these are are they the fits everybody yeah fits everybody thong pack they did them in briefs as well i'll link this below if it's still up 
um, on the website because it was $60. I did the math and it was a little bit less than getting it individual or on like their normal three for whatever sale. And I get mine in size small because they are so stretchy. I love these. They're also very... Oh wait, these look different. Why do they have more coverage on the back? The ones I have are like thongs. Anyway, I really liked this color. I don't wear these to the gym with my leggings because I like a laser cut thong. These ones have like seams at the top. So if you have like really thin leggings, I find that you could see the outline of these more underneath your leggings. But for everyday wear, these are amazing. So it comes with like this blue, black, a four screen, a neutral, and a white. They wash and wear very nicely and you can get like matching um bralettes why do i have on one today these are the only things i wear for bras this is like the triangle cut one um i'll link it below too they do matching colors uh yes yeah, so we love that and then this is what i'm most excited about it's in the shade graphite size small and it's a onesie i got one of these for myself last year in like this burgundy color and i live in that it is so nice and it's so easy to take on and off too because i pee all the time um it comes with an extra button so you can just like you don't even have to unbutton it to just slide it down but i really like these neutrals these sell out so fast, so I'll link them for you guys in case they are still up, maybe in some basic colors. They don't really come out with these unless it's like holiday, so if you've been wanting one, girl, go get you one of these. I had to resist the urge to get every color, uh, but I'm doing better with my shopping habits of just like, you know, satisfying myself without like going overboard with it. And then this. I've been wanting to treat myself to a Skims pajama set, right? But I didn't want to get the basic colors. I was hoping and waiting and wishing they would do like some limited edition shades because they have the black and the gray and like a white all the time. But I waited for this Cypress. Am I saying that right? And I got it in a size small. So I hope this fits me because I want to deal with returns. But Skims is really good about returns. This was expensive. That's why this was like one thing that I was really saving my money for. Oh my gosh. It matches those undies. It's like a forest green. And it's the soft lounge, like ribbed material. On the website though, like it's really hard to tell that it's ribbed. So it kind of looks like it's just like a regular basic cotton. They also do like the soft lounge robes which on the like website it also didn't look like it was ribbed so i'm curious to know if you guys have it is it ribbed or not because i've been wanting to get one of those as well but yeah these definitely look like they will run a little bit oversized so this is the top it has some nice weight to it i'm obsessed with this i cannot wait to put this on i'm about to put it in the washer right now so i'll link this set down below as well i think it is so cute and super cozy i don't really sleep with like pants but if i like want to just chill at home or like thanksgiving we're doing like a slumber party with my family this would be cute so this is what the top Ooh, and the sleeves are long yeah i almost got a medium but i know that her pants tend to run long in the crotch which these ones definitely look like they do and i don't want it to be too saggy and full length so i'm gonna put these on and see what it's giving but this is so cute so if you've been wanting one of these but you didn't want like a basic color girl go get one of these Ooh, and it hits the floor see this is cute i've been asleep i might get another color ignore the shirt underneath but for a small it's like perfect like it is loose but I mean they're lounge pants I feel like they definitely are flattering for it to be like a loose fit I just really like this color put some Uggs on yeah walk around cooking some dinner these are really cute you guys so I'm really happy with my latest Skims purchase and 
I don't know, I can't use that excuse of like, oh, it's a Christmas gift to myself because then I'll be buying everything. I'm just gonna open this last package from Too Faced. And then I gotta go edit. Matches my outfit. Oh my god, I was just about to go shopping for eyeshadow. So it looks like we have a new palette and ooh, I've never tried this one. The Better Than Sex Chocolate Mascara. Wow, look at these colors. Y'all, I am so minimal with my makeup, it's insane. Pretty sure the eyeshadow I have now in my makeup bag is expired. Better than chocolate. I love these Too Faced palettes. When I used to do my makeup all the time, these are the ones I would always reach for. There's a lot of like um, colors in here. I really wouldn't use like this color or this color. But these other ones, I think I probably wouldn't use that either. These other ones are really pretty. There's like some good matte like crease colors all over the lid shade. These I would definitely use in like my outer corner. These are so pretty. Oh, it's like a greenish brown. A lot of reflex in there. Um, Which one do I wanna swatch next? Wow, not me swatching makeup like my beauty guru days. This has a lot of like copper undertone to it. Let's do a matte. Pretty on the outer corner. Thank you, Too Faced. Y'all, I'm like rushing out the house as usual. I gotta hurry up and get ready. I definitely need a jacket, but all my coats and stuff are downstairs. So I'm just gonna do like a jeans and a cute top type of an outfit today. And I need to go fix my edges, but in my last video, I did like a cute little Shein fall haul. That's where this top is from. I think it's really cute with like a slick back look. So I tried it on in that video with these jeans and I remembered that it looked super cute. These are from Abercrombie and I love them. They actually fit my smaller waist with thicker thighs and they don't gape in the back. This will be cute. These do stretch out, I think, during the day. Whenever I wear them, I notice the waist gets a little bit bigger. But super simple. Whenever you don't know what to wear, jeans like high-waisted with like a cute crop top. So for my fragrance, I really want to reach for the Gourmand White Flowers from Dossier. It is their version of the Victor and Rolf Flower Bomb, which smells so good. also been obsessed with these like lip butter balms i got a tinted one i first tried these out with like the clear glosses they're like lip balms that moisturize but i wanted to get a tinted one this is in vanilla beige and it's from summer fridays i'll link these below too because i wear like brown liner all the time which is what i have and i thought this would be a nice like moisturizer with a little bit of color to kind of blend in without having to wear lipstick. So that's gonna be the vibe for today. Y'all already know my everyday bag has been the loop bag. So I'm just gonna use this. See, this is the regular vanilla one that I love that's almost out. This one is untinted. So it's nice to have both actually. Rings, and I think I wanna swap out my earrings. Feeling like a chubby hoop. So these are of course, um, Anna Louisa pieces. I love gold jewelry. I don't know if you guys can see. I could either do these little hoops, chubby hoops, or I just got these in in my monthly order for like a chubbier hoop as well, which I've been wanting to wear these. But they are also doing a Black Friday sale. Like these are just all of my favorites. I feel like 
I've been talking about in this video today. So if you need some good jewelry, definitely recommend heading over to Ana Luisa to get in on their discounts. Like I said, everybody has their freaking Black Friday sales going on. And it's the perfect time to save. Do we like them? They're definitely chubby. I don't know which one to wear. I kind of like these. Also, I wanted to show you guys my last package because I've been ordering stuff. There's literally one thing in there. so, And I kind of wanted to test it out today. rings today we don't need to go too crazy too 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 crazy yeah i feel like that's cute like it just jazzes up simple outfits and i don't know what shoes to wear maybe i'll wear these boots they have such a cute little heel they're from zara not them with the dust yeah that's so cute because it's like a casual little heel i don't know if it's gonna fit in my bag This big old box, y'all. Oh, the packaging is cute. I've never had anything from the Necessaire brand, but I wanted to try their hand cream. So I'll link it below. It's fragrance free. So I was looking for a good hand cream that wouldn't irritate cracked dry hands that would also be like very rich because I have like eczema prone skin and I wash my hands constantly. This is a really cute minimalistic packaging that's what i wanted something aesthetic it's kind of pricey for a hand cream but not fragrance that would irritate the cracked dry skin so i don't know why i just smelled it knowing dang well it is fragrance free but it comes out very thick It doesn't even have like a um, natural scent, but I would say like texture wise, it's not thick and sticky. It's definitely a thinner, richer, smooth, not tacky, hydrates. Yeah, that's gonna be really nice. I need to put that in my car though, because girl, we need the hand cream everywhere we go. But it does actually fit in my bag, which is nice, so. We love that. But I'm gonna head out. I'm gonna pick out my coat in the coat closet, and then we're out of here. Casual. Am I overdressed for Carabas? I don't know. Do I care? No, because I don't really leave the house, so I'll take it. I love this coat, y'all. It is so cozy. Um, moisturizer. It's like number one. 